Disgraced Hollywood mogul Harvey Weinstein has been found guilty of rape and a criminal sex act for assault in a New York courtroom. However, he was acquitted on three other charges, the most serious, predatory sexual assault. CBS legal analyst Steve Meiser weighs in. It could have been worse, but I doubt that Harvey Weinstein is really thinking that tonight. Weinstein also faces four felony counts of sexual assault in Los Angeles. But Meister says what happened in New York on Monday means nothing in terms of what will happen in L.A. It's a separate case, separate charge, separate jurisdiction, different witnesses, different victims, different facts. Facts control a case. And so no matter what happened in another jurisdiction, that's not going to matter here, and it shouldn't. Almost two years ago, the 67-year-old turned himself over to police, charged with raping a woman in a hotel room in March of 2013 and forcibly performing a sex act on another woman in 2006. Dozens of women came forward against Weinstein. Actress Elizabeth Moss has spoken freely about the Me Too movement. She spoke to us about Weinstein's conviction. Honestly, my heart is just with the people that have been victimized and the people that um, deserve justice. And so I would just say I hope that, you know, I don't know if it's possible, but I hope it brings them some comfort. Now, the judge will sentence Weinstein next month. He is facing anywhere between 5 to 25 years in prison. Live in the newsroom, Brittany Hopper, KCAL 9 News.